DC gang back with another one man hey, amen say man <sighs> quick video I know I said the vlog again so I'm giving y'all a cool little video today don't mind my uh, junk but it's been a minute since y'all seen this car I'm gonna give y'all a quick little update so as y'all know this is my DC4 Integra LS don't mind all the junk over here I gotta really come out here later and clean this garage out. But this is my DC4 Integra. Oh snap. Let's go the kicks. Fire. Well, you can see I have this mean little dent in the quarter panel. So, also on the side right here, I'm on this stuff. On the side right here, I have some uh, damage. You can see that scrape on the door. See right there by the fender. So this car, right? I've been thinking about fixing this car for like the past like year and some change. And I've been recently looking for a car because like you know what? I want to start driving my Integra again, especially because I just recently finished paying off my Camaro. So I got some extra funds in the bank. You feel me? But I've recently went to speak to the body shop that I was gonna fix that was supposed to fix this car. Went up there, I had an estimate which was 46 and some change, 4,600 some change, right? And went up there to see like, hey, because I pretty much have that right now, right? And I was like, you know what? Let me go up there and see what they're talking about so I can find a date in December so I can get this car fixed. Well, after going up there and them telling me, like, you know what? We can't do it because what they were planning to do, right? They needed to cut this whole part out. Or well, maybe they're gonna cut this part out. I don't know exactly how they're gonna do it, but they're trying to find this and they can't. I tried to look for another shell, cheap shell that had this side that was good in the door, so I could just swap it over and get it painted. They're supposed to give me an estimate, but I don't know. And then the 4600 that they told me, honestly, it wasn't the end. It wasn't the final price, which I didn't know until I went up there last week. And they're like, yeah, we didn't give you the final price because this and that. Well, I hit them up. I found a shell and, and to get the work done. They're supposed to give me an estimate, but they never got back to me. Now, granted, I can call them back and see what's up, but I know the rates went up for labor, all that stuff, right? With inflation, blah, blah, blah. And I was thinking like, you know what? As much work as it's going to take me to get this car back up and running, I don't think I'm going to do that anymore. For the simple fact of I still have wiring issues with the signals and the brakes and rotors is not a big deal. That's just like 250 to get. Same brake caliper and not brake caliper, but brakes and rotor setup that I got for the Camaro, which is dyno something, I forget. But drill slider rotor is gonna look nice. You get some new wheels, boom. Pretty much if I had got this fixed, just paint, they're supposed to change all the window seals and all that stuff, right? Well, since it didn't get back to me, I've been looking at other cars and I've been looking at just getting into a whole different platform, still keeping it at Honda, but looking for another type of Honda, right? So I've been looking at Civics and I've always wanted the EM1 the SI 2099SI, right? True SI, not a clone, I want a true SI. And those things are expensive, bro. They've been, if you've been watching my lives, because I've been going on live like twice about this looking at cars and give you guys this feedback and stuff like that for those who tap into the lives and I know some people never watch this vlog because I really don't be vlogging no more I just play the game the reason I don't really vlog is because I honestly don't have anything to vlog about like what am I going to vlog about like I don't know if I had to go to the field because you know I'm in the army if I go to the field then I record that or you know I record that kind of stuff if I get deployed but I haven't the car mainly was I mean the channel was mainly it was a car channel before I started doing um the gaming stuff and the game is just so I can just game people actually been subscribing because of the game content cool and I appreciate y'all that's super dope but back to the car so I've decided to not fix this car I'm gonna part it out and I need to part this out within like a month I've been looking at civics to get SI's been going for like 9k 10k bro it's crazy and I don't talk about EM1 I'm not talking about 8th gen and sorry about all the background noise but 
I was thinking about getting an 8th gen because it's literally like close to the same price as an EM1 would be. I'm just like, should I go and get that? It's more modern and stuff like that. But at the same time, I don't want to just get a daily. I have a daily. My camera is my daily. That's why I haven't built it. That's my daily. I want a project car. And I don't want to start over from scratch though, right? I don't want to start over from scratch. If I was to get another Integra, which I've seen a couple of Integras, LSs, GSRs, but they're going for like the same price as the EM1. I was like, might as well get an EM1 so I can get to a different platform. If I was to get an Integra, I can literally drop all these parts right into that and be cool. I can still do the JD on front. I just have to cut off the radiator support and I can get it welded. And it's like, do I want to do that though? You know what I'm saying? Or do I want to do something different? So I'm kind of torn in between, but I'm aiming more towards a Civic. I'll show you guys a couple of Civics right here that I've been looking at on uh, Facebook Market and stuff like that. And there's one that's been standing out to me. Well, they all been standing out to me. But for the price wise, there's one that's been standing out to me and I kind of want to get that one. And or just, I mean, honestly, one that I can afford. I don't want to get nothing that's like crazy and nothing like that. I really don't care if it has the original motor in it or not because honestly, I'm going to drop this motor in there and I'm going to show you guys what I have. Obviously, yeah, I got, and this is the parts I was talking about. I got the bar right here for the harness, the harness bar right here, Recaro seats, Type R, uh, climate control over there, Type R, boom. You know, it's done up. It's done up, it's cool. Let's see if I can get past this. All right. And I'm going to show you all under the hood, and this is why I want to stay in the B-Series room. Oh, that my camera's done. That's why I want to stay in the B-Series room. It's because of this. Obviously, carbon fiber hood. Boom. Well, this right here. This is why I don't care about what other car I get next, as long as it's a Honda, because I can throw all this right into it. Whether I get a Civic, another Integra. It's, everything's already built. The car is already ready to go. Only thing I need is another clutch. You know what I'm saying? Uh, a stronger clutch, like a stage five or something like that. But yeah. Currently, this car is uh, it's on the eBay Turbo, eBay Special. The Turbo is like $110, honestly, when I got it, which was like back in 2001. Car makes 382, built for five, but you know, because of Turbo. Like it on the uh, exhaust side, I can't put out that much. So we make 382. So I'm just thinking like, you know what? Let me just get another one. Because like I said, I can, if I wanted to, I can just get the Integra, throw this front on there, call it cool. But I really don't want to do something to where I got to like do some more welding and stuff like that. I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to do all that, honestly. So I'm just thinking like, if I'm going to get something else, why not get something different? Everything that I can salvage off here, I will salvage and either keep or sell, you know? So like the passenger side door, all the mirrors, the bumpers, the front end, the trunk, obviously the wheels, all that stuff. So yeah, this is a quick video. Just let y'all know what I've been up to with the car and the plan. So um, if everything goes as planned, I'm trying to get this SI next month. So I'll keep you up to date on that. But this is just updated in Integra because I know I don't give you guys too many updates. You can see that it's very much neglected. There's all kind of crap in the car. You know what I mean? So, but everything in here, including the seats and everything, I can just throw it right into the SI. So, as long as the body's good, I'm going to just throw my whole build into there. Because the build is mainly everything inside the car and the motor, not really the outside other than the carpet hood. I never paid for the paint. Somebody hit me when I was in Hawaii. That's how I got the car painted. Came with the JD in front. I got the hood because I smacked my other hood. When I put the turbo one back in uh, Texas and I forgot to put the freaking la the hood latches back on. And uh, when I hit their gear, hood flew up. It made a little pretty dent in the top of the hood. If you guys can see that little dent right there. And that's why I got the hood. Other than that, I haven't really paid nothing for it except for the headlights too. But yeah, man. That is the update on the on the build. Um, coming soon. Hopefully this guy gives me some. Uh, you know. Hopefully things go well with this with this with this sell. 
and I'm in the SI. <laughs> and we're gonna, we gonna continue to build in 2025. So, all those who are on the channel and still rocking me for the car content, this is it. Obviously, yes, I have a garage, but the car literally just sits here. So in the next month, I'm gonna be parting this out completely and getting it ready to get towed out of here, taken to the junkyard, and they gonna do what they do with it, you know, one of those cash for car things, and yeah. But this is what's going on with the Integra. This is going on with the build. It's time to go ahead and demantle this like I did the white Integra to nothing and just try to sell what I can and yeah, that's it. That is the update. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it's pretty short, little 10 minute video. I'm probably never gonna put an intro on here, but yeah, man. It's Saturday, I'm better go to the movies or something. I'm gonna go see that one movie with Santa. Well, with the rock hands to save Santa or something like that with the other guy. Uh, I'm going to go watch that. I don't have nothing else to do today. It's pretty boring. It's the fit, though. Oh, man. It's the fit. You see the bandana on the shoe, though? Ooh! But, yeah. New car coming soon. Uh, if this one don't work out, I'm still trying to get an M1 unless I can find... I've seen an Integra with a JD on front. Also for sale, so that's a possibility. It's all black. I'll put that one up here, too. Y'all let me know which y'all which think I should get. Obviously, the decision of my own. I know what I'm going to get. But which one of these Civics do you guys like the best? Just by looking at it, the pictures, I don't, you know. And, or the Integra. Which one y'all want? This car is done. Just getting parted out. That's it. It's over with. It's over. It's over. But, yeah. I'm going to start tomorrow. I'm going to come through here. I'm going to clean things up some so I can have room so I can start pulling out the parts. And the last thing I'm going to do is take out the motor. The motor is the last thing I'm going to take off. Because after that, well, not the last thing, but before I take the wheels and suspension off. So, I had to make some room in here, get it a little bit more organized. So, I would have places to put parts and make them all nice and neat in a tough box. But other than that, that's the Danny Integra. I see everybody got their shit going. Shout out to Zosh. I'll be seeing you. My time, he out in Japan, I believe. He just put his K-Series in there, you know. I'll be seeing y'all do y'all shit. I'm just like, y'all to get back on mine. I'm just building my car, and it's just been sitting. And if I would have knew this was going to happen, and I wasn't going to get it fixed, I would have been saved up. So when I got back from Korea, I could have just bought a car, and we could have just been on this. I'm going to have to get another. If I don't get this part out in time, I'm going to just get another garage here and throw the Civic in there. I'm trying to finish parting this out, and I can have room. And then I'll just bring the Civic in here and we'll start building. And I'll show you guys the whole process of me building. If y'all want to see me, if y'all want to see the part out process, I'll, I'll show y'all. It don't really be too interesting, but if y'all want me to post that, let me know. So y'all can see the videos of me taking this apart. Or I'll just record it throughout time and I'll just put it all together in one whole thing and just make one whole video. Got me parting out the whole car over time. And yeah. Because I'm in Colorado, P5 Speed is out here. So I'm trying to go ahead and get another car get a bigger turbo, get another clutch, and take it to them and have, it, have them tune it. I did go to their event, if you guys didn't see that, the PFI Speed My bad, camera died. <laughs> the PFI Speed Fest that was out here in Colorado, I went to that. If you guys haven't seen that vlog, make sure you guys check it out. I'll put it in the suggestions at the end of this video so I can check out the whole event. It's pretty long. I wasn't talking much to it. It's just a whole bunch of car content, you know? But that was dope, and I want to get my car, not this car, but I want to get my next car ready so that way I can actually go to the next event when the weather gets better. It's winter season. I don't want to show you all the snow, but there's snow out here. <laughs> a little bit left. But we're headed, we're in winter now. So that gives me time to get another build, fix it up, get it ready for the track. And uh, yeah, I'm not really trying to go out there to like really, I don't want to say I don't want to win because there's, there's fast versions out there. There's, there's fast guys out there if you guys watch this video. We all watch the video, y'all gonna see it's super fast cars out there. I just wanna go out there to take my car to the track and just experience that. You know what I'm saying? Yes, yeah, a project car, but I really wanna just have a fun little project street car. I'm not trying to have something that's gonna I'm gonna be blowing up consistently. I'm not trying to go K series. I've seen a couple of Hondas that have K's in them. I don't wanna go K series. I wanna stick with the B's. I'm not trying to be the fastest person out there. I just want a nice build. I'm familiar with B series. And especially if the one of the civics that are, that I've seen. One has a B16, all original parts from factory. One has a LS, but has a B16 trans. And uh, I wouldn't mind just, you know, 
I'll show you guys this again. I wouldn't mind just throwing this in there. Throwing that in there. This is my thumbnail. Throwing this in there and uh, whatever other engine I get, I can just build that one up. And I'll have an engine I can actually like build and learn how to like put valves in and stuff like that. So eventually when this one, you know, needs some work, I can just swap the motor or I can um, throw the other one in. It is what it is. But yeah, that's the update. Just wanted to give you a quick little video. Like I said, my camera died. <laughs> the camera died, but yeah. Coming soon, man. Coming soon. So hope y'all, you know, enjoyed this video. Like, share, subscribe, all the good stuff. Closing it, closing it now. And uh, I'll see y'all next upload. Peace. All right, so I'm gonna close this out. I finally cleaned the garage. So I took a lot of stuff out of here to make room. Move my tires out of here. As you see, I organized it on my jacks right here. Everything's ready for part out. The car is clean and the inside. Well, not clean, clean, but I got all the parts out other than the trunk. This is stuff I still got to throw away. But as of right now, it can stay right here until I start uh, pulling some more parts off. But yeah, I got to clean it here. This stuff I got to like throw away still. I'm tired now, but Everything's all organized. I have to organize all my tools. This is all parts right here. And like everything that's a part is in here. Extra parts, gaskets, manual, starters, distributors, water pumps, all kind of stuff. All my uh, wrenches are in here. The sockets are on the bottom. And this is my specialty tools and my ratchet wrenches and stuff like that. So, and then all the POL, like all the oils and stuff like that. Or if there's this POL related, it's right there. And this is just like wires and shit or whatever. But yeah, we are officially about to start this part out. Um, I'm going to start the part out next weekend, I want to say. Maybe next weekend. I'm going to try. I'm going to see. If not, then we can after that for sure. I already found a car. Uh, I'll just let you guys know right now. I'll just let you guys know. What, actually, no, I ain't going to tell you what car it is. I ain't going to tell you what car it is. But if they still have it, then I'm going to pick it up in December. So mid-December, I'll go picking up this car if they still have it. For right now, I'm on a time crunch to get all this out. <laughs> all this out, unless it's like stock. Like I'm not taking like the fuel filter off or anything like that. But everything that I purchased that's like performance parts, I'm taking off, obviously. I got a whole lot of performance parts. <laughs> whole lot of performance parts. And uh, yeah, that also gives me time to when I take them off. I can clean them up and stuff, you know, so we got this car is officially getting parted out. So if anybody needs a part, let me know. I'm definitely going to, um, I'm definitely keeping <laughs> that. I'm definitely keeping that, that radiator support so I can keep the whole JDM front, but I could probably sell that for sure. Everything else though is coming off. Even the sunroof, I'm even taking the sunroof off. I'm taking the trunk off, doors. So, well, this door, the PCI side skirts I'm taking off, rear bumper, suspension. I got um, I got True Heart suspension on here. Taking that off, my Type R brace bar. You know, I got stuff on underneath the car. I'll show you guys. I'll take all that off. Subframe brace, lower control arms the exhaust so a lot is coming off of this car and y'all will be here to witness it i'm not gonna probably i'm honestly probably not gonna record me taking all this stuff off because i want to take off as fast as possible but i will let y'all see it before and after when i take all this shit off and where i'm going to put all this stuff at is in this corner i would say there's stuff right here right now but that's just so i can i just need everything organized for now so that way when I start doing all the disassembling and stuff, but eventually everything is going to be up against this wall right here. So I'm going to talk to the, uh, I got in contact with a place that picks up cars, like cash for cars or whatever. I'm not expecting to get nothing from it for what I, for what I'm going to give them. But as long as they take this shit off my hands, that's good enough for me. Honestly, they can give me a six pack and I'll be good for real. Cause I'm going to pretty much leave this car with, uh, nothing. So, yeah, 
I held on to it for two years, trying to figure it out, uh, getting deployed and everything, and there's just no saving this car, bro. It's gone. But we're going to get into something else. And best believe, it's going to be something that I can throw a B-Series in it. So it can be another Integra. You feel me? It could be another LS Integra. It could be a GSR, JDM. I'm not getting that thing right-hand drive. Don't worry about that. I'm not doing that. It could be an EG, EK. It's going to be something that I could put a B-Series in it. Just believe that. Just know that. But the views is coming back. So, yeah. Like, share, subscribe, all the good stuff, man. I'm off EB. Ooh, I can't wait to put that in a... Just imagine, this is already done. This is done already. I literally just got to drop that in a car. Because I already got the ECU. Everything's already tuned. I literally just got to drop that in another shell. And we're good to go. Whoo, I'm excited. I'm excited.